Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? And what we have here 4 raised to the power x minus 2 equals to 60. Here, this follows when we have a raised to the power n minus n, this same thing as a raised to the power n over a raised to the power n. That is, here we have 4 raised to the power x over 4 squared equals to 60 here. That is, we can write this as 4 raised to the power x over 4 squared, 4 times 4 is 16, equals to, here we have 60 over 1. That is, next step here, we cross multiply, 4 raised to the power x times 1, same thing as 4 raised to the power x, equals to, here we have 60 times 16. That is, from here, we take the log on both sides, here we have log. 4 raised to power x equals to log 60 times 16. At this here, we apply the power law of logarithm when we have log m raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. At this here, we have x log 4 equals to log 60 times 16. Then, also here, we apply the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, the same thing as log a plus log b. At this here, we have x log 4 equals to log 60 plus log 16. At this, here we divide both sides by log 4. Divide this side by log 4. Also, divide this side by log 4. Which implies here log 4 cancelled each other. And we have x equals to log 60 plus log 16 over log 4. That is. Next step here, we separate this into two fractions, and we have x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus log 16 over log 4. Then, from here, 16 can be expressed as 4 times 4, which is 4 squared. And this becomes x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus log 4 squared over log 4. Then we apply the power of log here. 2 comes here and we have x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus 2 log 4 over log 4. Then here we have log 4 cancelled each other. 2 left here. All we have becomes x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus 2. Then from here also 60 can be written as 4 times 15. And all we have becomes x equals to log. 4 times 15 over log 4 plus 2. Then here, also this follows the law of logarithm. We have x equals to log 4 plus log 15 over log 4 plus 2. Then we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 4 over log 4 plus log 15 over log 4 plus 2 that is next step here we have log 4 cancel each other one left here and we have x equals to 1 plus 2 that's 3, then plus log 15 over log 4. 
15. Also here, 15 can be expressed as 3 times 5. At this scale, we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 times 5 over log 4. And this also follows the law of logarithm, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 4. Then we separate this into two fractions, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 over log 4 plus log 5 over log 4. Then also 4 can be expressed as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared. At this here we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 over log 2 squared plus log 5 over log 2 squared. And we apply the power of logarithm. 2 comes here and also here. Then we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 over 2 log 2 plus also we have log 5 over 2 log 2. That is, we can write this as x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 times log 3 over log 2 plus also 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 2. Then, here we apply change of base. When we have log A over log B, the same thing as log A to base B. That is, here we have x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 log 3 base 2 plus 1 over 2 log 5 base 2. Then we bring this together as one fraction. And we have x equals to the SCM here as 2. And this is 3 over 1. So this becomes 6 then plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. That is here we have the value of x in this problem. Then let's check if this satisfies this given problem. That is substitute the value of x here. Which is x equals to 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. At this here, what we have becomes 4 base to power 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2, then minus 2. This is equals to 60 on this side. Then, next step here, we bring this power together as one. This is 2 over 1. That is, we have 4 raised to power. SCM up here, that's 2. Here, we still have 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2, then minus 4 here. This is equals to 60 on this side. That is 6 minus 4, that's 2. And that is as 4 raised to the power 2, then plus log 3 base 2, plus log 5 base 2, all over 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? And also 4 here can be written as 2 square, which is raised to the power 2 plus log 3 base 2, plus log 5 base 2 all over 2 is this equals to 60 on this side then this power multiplies and 2 here cancelled each other we have 2 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 is this equals to 60 on this side that is here this follows the law of indices rise as 2 squared times 
2 raised to the power log 3 base 2 times 2 raised to the power log 5 base 2 is this equals to 60 on this side and 2 square 2 times 2 that's 4 and times this follows when we have a raised to the power log b to base a which is equals to b at this here we have 3 then times 5 is this equals to 60 from here 2 times 3 that's 12 times 5 that's 60 equals to 60 here we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. And turn the notification bell on. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up and put your comments. See you next class. Bye for now.